Welcome to the Ramadan market. Let's see what's inside. Oh, is this only for Ramadan or anytime you guys have it? Uh, for, especially for Ramadan. Oh, okay, Ramadan food guys, awesome. First I'm trying out Ferni, let's give it a try. Try it. Fizzy masala drink, masala, masala oh, drink. Alright. not be spicy. Wow. It's tripping. Hello and welcome to another day here in India. Currently I'm here in Kolkata. And today I want to show you the Muslim area of Kolkata. This over here, you see this little archway over here is called Zakaria Street. And it's called Nakoda Mosque Gate. Because uh, I believe I'm pronouncing it right. So this is Nakoda. Let's, let, let's walk away from this all this noise. But let's go inside and see how it is. Alright, calm down a little bit. So anyways, this area is supposed to be famous for having a lot of street foods. Also, right now it's Ramadan. So Ramadan Mubarak to all my Muslims that are out there right now. So it's Muslim, so it's Ramadan. And I want to just show you the Muslim area here in Kolkata because Kolkata has a few million Muslims. So I was like, might as well just show you the area and let you see how it is. It's nighttime right now. So yeah, let's just investigate and see the Muslim area. I just ate an hour ago because I just went to this one place called the Indian Coffee Shop, which is famous here in Kolkata as well. So I'm not very hungry, but that's not gonna stop us from just seeing what people are doing and stuff. You just see, it already looks like there's already some street food. Hello, hi. Look at this. Hello. Making some bread? Bread? Nice. Bread. He has a bread over there. Then you look at all these vegetables. Really cool guys chilling over here. It's only uh, 7 o'clock about 7 o'clock p.m. So sun does go down here pretty early. The sunset around here, if you're wondering, is around 5 o'clock. It's like around 5.40, 5.50. I have to reconfirm on that just real quick. But yeah, check it out. A lot of... So we look towards our right. Uh, yeah, let's we'll just walk towards our right a little bit and just see how it is. We're walking off of Zakaria Road real quick. Seems like a lot of people are shipping a lot of stuff. Seems like it could be like a shipping district area. But we're more focused towards going to Zakaria Road. And seeing the mosque over here too. All right. Something that you and I, you might not be used to, or I'm not really used to, is that like constantly here in Kolkata, you'll be hearing horns and all different sounds. Just as I'm saying, like, whoa, so loud, so loud. Yeah, it does not stop. Literally, anytime in the city, I just hear it. And probably if you see some of my other videos here, you'll hear horns constantly. Ramadan Mubarak. Happy Republic Day. Okay, cool. Hi, how are you? Good? So are, are you guys from Kolkata? Yes. So this is Zakaria Street, right? Yes, Zakaria Street. Th just straight, this is Zakaria Street. So what is this street famous for? For street food. Street food, street food? Actually, actually now the uh, uh, Ramzan season is going on, now. Yeah. So, so, so that's why actually, so for this, for this Ramzan time, yeah. this Zakaria Street is very much attractive. Uh, only for because it's street foods. There yeah. are lots of lots of foods, different kinds of foods. There are uh, uh, various street foods, okay. and even and and even uh, very renowned then uh, restaurants also. Then mm. we six Tasti. You can go and, and check so. check it out. Okay. Yeah, and uh, there are many more uh, like uh, foods. There yeah. are kebabs. There are fruits. There are uh, lassi. There are. Uh, what we have eaten that many kinds uh, of fruits kebabs, many kind of fruits kebabs yeah. afghani kebab lots of lots of foods so are you a vlogger too because i see yeah, you have uh, yes yes i am just i'm just a new new joiner in this vlogging community new vlogger <laughs> all right awesome yeah uh you have youtube or what do you have uh yeah yeah i i do have a youtube channel so uh, it will mm -hmm. be going on on next week i guess oh you didn't uh, start it yet 
Do you know that's name? Maybe yeah, yeah. I can help share your channel. Yeah, yeah. Its name is uh, Smiling Together. Smiling Together. Yeah. Smiling. And how do you spell it? Normal s uh, spelling? No. Yeah. Normal spelling. Smiling, Smiling together. together. So what is your uh, channel going to be yeah, about? Actually, actually, me and my girlfriend have started this uh, this channel. Is that your girlfriend? No, no. No, no. I'm just joking. Just like <laughs> yeah. So, uh, so uh, like, uh, we have just done one or two videos. Just okay. Now, and we will start uh, start uploading this. So this is how this is going on. So what what kind of videos are you gonna yeah, be doing? Yeah, we will do just just our normal day vlogs. We are uh, like some uh, someday we will go to hang out some uh, some places. Then we will uh, try few foods over there. So that's it. Mm, okay. Normal daily life vlog. You see that normal daily life vlog. So guys, just follow him. Hopefully you'll get one million subscribers. <laughs> I hope so. I hope so too. So you guys follow me too. You know? Yeah. That's awesome. Thank you. All right. Cool. So. Uh, because uh, this is my first time here in Zakaria Road, so this is a, uh, yeah, this is, is this a Muslim? Oh, oh, are you not from Kolkata? No, we are from Kolkata, but okay. I mean, we were just planning to come State, to this oh, for the last three, four years, but this year we just. So is this this is a Muslim area of Kolkata? Yeah, yeah. yeah okay, yeah. Muslim area, cool. That, that's what I thought. That's what I saw online. Yes. What uh, is your channel name? My name is Traveling Solo Logs. You can see my channel. Yeah, sure. Something in Kolkata, I'm not as Hong Kong, Kong, every second, <laughs> every second. It's something I'm not used to from where I'm from. Let's see if my vlog comes out the first, guys. Solo. <laughs> kind of curious. Logs, all right, actually, it came out second. Not bad. Yeah, this one? Yeah, this is me. Subscribe. Awesome, thank you so much. Yep. You're my newest nice subscriber. You. Thank you. Nice to meet you too. What is your name? Snehal. Snehal Nam. Snehal, my name is Solomon. Yeah. Thanks. What is your name? Abilal, Abilal Bishash. Abilal Bishash. All right, nice to meet you. Nice yeah, to nice to meet you too. Guys, take care. And I'm going to be just investigating the Sakaria Street. Yeah. Hopefully, see some nice food, yeah. see some nice people, just like you two. Yeah. All right, take care. Luck, yeah. Bye. Bye. Good night. You too. Wow, look at this. All right, let's go, guys. Those guys were nice. And uh, I think part of the shot. Man, it's so loud, I can't concentrate. Yeah, part of the shot. I may have twisted the camera a little bit away from us, but that's okay. I'm just gonna continue on. So this guy, professional, head balancer, the big box. Sorry, excuse me. You have to really navigate through these streets, and <coughs> my throat feels very heavy right now. My throat is not in what I want to say. I'm not used to this kind of environment. Yeah, it's a bit too dusty over here, but it's all right. Yeah. Wow, well, look at this, a lot of different chips. I want to show you here in India, Lay's have different types of like flavors. We have Indian magical masala, chili lime flavor, classic salted. Spanish tomato, they have so many different types of Lay's flavors. Like, we're not, in America we don't have these flavors, but chili lemon I had it the other day was very good. I may have to do like a whole video, like show you guys the different Lay's flavors. Oh, and they also over there have sizzling hot. Hi, sir. Actually, I want, I want water. Oh, and something else I want to show you guys real quick. Like I just bought this thing called Thumbs Up. I don't know if you guys can see it in the food trader. Thumbs Up is, uh, it's like the Pepsi of India, thumbs up. Or the Coca-Cola of India. Okay, I'm gonna show you real quick. This is a thumbs up, guys. <sighs> what do I want? I want water. I'm gonna see if he has water. So my throat is really getting so... Uh... Actually, maybe instead of water, I'll get some like small... Let me get some drink. I haven't had Mountain Dew in a while. Can I have one Mountain Dew, please? Uh, 20, okay. Mountain Dew. What is this one, Jiru? Jiro, 20 rupees. So I let me try out Jiro. I never had Jiro before. Jiro. Yeah, yeah Jiro. <laughs> I was going to try out Mountain Dew, but I had it in America before, but I never had Jiro. I wonder what Jiro is like. G, uh, Jiru. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Jiru, guys. Let's give it a try. Jiru. Hi, sir. 
Hello. Have you had Jiru before? No, I have not tried it. I haven't tried it out either. I'm kind of curious how it tries. Yeah, try it. Fizzy masala drink. Masala, masala no, drink. All right. It will not be spicy. Huh? It will not be spicy. Okay. Because uh, masala flavor is usually spicy. Yeah, okay. it can be. All right, let me try it out. And you are from which country? From America. Oh. Where, where are you guys from? From India. I know, yeah, from India, but like from Kolkata or? Yeah, from Kolkata. Kolkata, okay. Native. The street is very interesting. I mean, the yeah, streets of Kolkata, well, actually, this one is interesting too, yeah, but. This is festive time, so that is why they have decorated and all. So if you come other time, it's not so crowded. Do you come here often? Not often. This is our first time. First time? Wow, are you from Kolkata? Yeah. You, you know, you're the second people I meet. They tell me this is the first time they come to uh, uh, Zakaria Street. People are coming here only for food because ah. you can get all different type of food in this time. Oh, uh, wow. Because it's Ramadan, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, so you guys heard that. In Ramadan, a lot of people come from all over Kolkata just to see that. Yeah. So I have a YouTube channel, so yeah. Okay. So now let's try out the Jiru. Let's see, this one. Wow. So you are. Spicy? <laughs> it's not spicy. It has a lot of spices inside of it. It tastes strange. It's like a fizzy drink with a lot of spices. But do you like it or not? Let me give it one more try and I'll let you know. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. I don't, I don't think it's my favorite, but it's okay. I probably wouldn't get it again, to be honest with you, but. It's interesting taste. Yeah, like, it's, I'll it's, finish it. Definitely, I'll finish it. It's like it's not disgusting or bad or anything like that. But it's just not. It's like it's like a fizzy drink with a lot of different like spices. Masala yeah, it's spices. It's not so popular yeah. here. I have not seen it many. Yeah, times. I never. I never had it before. I was going to try Mountain Dew, but I was like, let's try it out. So you guys can add me on my uh, YouTube. Get, yeah. And you can see yourself on YouTube. Press subscribe. Yep, that's me. So I've been and now I'm just making a lot of videos here in Kolkata and then I'm going to go to probably Chennai. Okay, but that would be really hot there now. Really? I think here is very you hotter than here? Yeah, it would be more humid there. It wow, because be, because right now I see you're sweating. Yeah, oh yeah. my so god. If you go to Chennai it would be similar weather there. He's not preparing me for Chennai because because <laughs> I see right no, now you're on. very hot and I'm very hot too. <laughs> oh Chennai. Uh. Have you have you been to Chennai before? Yeah of course I did. Yeah. I mm. stayed in yeah. southern India for some time. Okay. So would you say Chennai is better than here? Kolkata is no, better? You should experience it. It's different. It's completely different. Foods are different. People are different. Everything is different. Oh, okay. Yeah, you will experience complete different culture and vibes here. Oh, wow. All right. Cool. Yeah, you should try. It. Awesome. Well, ni nice to meet you. Yeah, of course. So how long would be here? Uh, I'm going to be here for like uh, for Kolkata. Just here for a few more days and then I'm going to go with my friend and then we're going to be in Chennai. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, nice. how, how long will you be here? No, I'm just joking. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, okay, nice to meet you soon. Luck. Yeah. Take care. Bye. 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 Awesome, nice vibes. And this drink, ah, uh, Jiru. Sorry if you guys like it or not. But I'm not feeling it. I'll finish it just because I don't like to waste food and drinks. But it's not my favorite. Alright. Oh, wow. I said, wow? <laughs> That's like this wow. I straight ahead. Look at that. There's a moon and a star. A lot of music, too. And something I noticed, a lot of Muslims over here in, in India, they like to wear a kufi. A kufi is the hat what you wear on top of your head. I'm not sure how you say it in Indian, a uh, language like Hindi or in Bengali, but... Uh, yeah, it's called a kufi in Arabic. Maybe they call it kufi too, I'm not sure. Cool. It's interesting drink. It's a fizzy drink with a lot of spices. It's like, hard to describe it. It's like masala, yeah, exactly what it says. Masala uh, drink. Let's see, can we see what it says inside? Ah, uh, there's just a lot of chemicals inside of it. It's all right, uh, here. What I'm gonna do with this drink, I'm gonna put it in here, in my little pouch that I always travel with. My little man purse. Make sure it's sealed. I don't want anything leaking. All right, it's good. What is that sound? Maybe it's a Hindu temple or something? Yeah, all right, so over here, I think it's a Hindu temple. Wow. And I think that guy over here is a police officer. 
Let's see what's happening over here. Wow. Man, these motorcycles come out of nowhere. They almost ran me over. I'm gonna show you over here. So they have a lot of like promotion over here. Ramazan, Barakatan, Biryani and Kebab only for 100 Indian rupees. Which is about like a dollar ten, a dollar twenty. Assalamu alaikum. I got dates, a lot of fruits here. Everyone, welcome to the Ramadan market, officially. Let's see what's inside. So as the people just told me that a lot of people that are not even Muslim, they come here just to visit because there's a lot of street foods over here. Let's check out the vibes and see what it is, how it is. What is this? Looks like wheat or something. Pure food. Wow, okay. I haven't seen this before. Let's see if the guy speaks English. Hello. What is this? This is Asawi. Asawi. Is this kind of wheat or something? This is uh, made from wheat. Made from wheat. You eat it for breakfast or something? No, it's a kind breakfast. of dessert actually. It's, it's a si okay. This is called semai. Oh, it's a kind of dessert? Yeah. So you buy it and then you make it in a kind of dessert like this? Yeah, yeah just like that. Oh. So we, we put a... Uh, we, uh, including with... Uh, we, we cook it with milk. Yeah? Yeah, we, uh, it will be soaked for a while and after that it, uh, it will be ready for dessert as a dessert is, is this a ramadan can, dessert you can put uh, you can put uh, dry fruits as well wow is this only for ramadan or anytime you guys have it uh, for, especially for ramadan oh, okay ramadan food guys awesome all right cool thank you brother thank you Assalamualaikum. let me sh show you guys over here man i, I should have came here hungry guys unfortunately i'm not hungry as i said i just ate but look over here we got some like chicken over here on a stick we have a green one you see over there and then we have like a red one i love it everyone's just staring hello hi guys there we go my friend over here vlogging too <laughs> wow look at that Hi sir, how are you? Good. Yeah, how are you? Good. Alhamdulillah. Ramadan market. I I think I need to make a thumbnail for this video. I still haven't made a thumbnail. I just have to be careful of. Oh, I think I do one over here. Take off my glasses. Okay, I think it's good. Good enough. Put back my glasses. And let's go. What? Huh? Hi, uh, you do speak English? I don't, I don't speak. I don't speak Hindi. Yeah, Bengali. Where do you come from? Ah, uh, from America. America. Where do you come from? Uh, India, Kolkata, Howrah. Kolkata, Howrah. Oh, Howrah, Howrah. Which channel? Which channel? Here, you wanna see? I'll show you right now. What, what are you eating? What is this? It's, it's called pini. Pini. Okay. Pindi. A dessert? Something uh, sweet? Uh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, okay, nice. Very good. Very good. Well, where did you get this from? Where? Oh, from here. Pini. Okay. Pini. I might... Halim. Halim is very good. Halim. Halim. Oh, okay. Very good. Okay, I might have to try it out. Okay. Is your channel name? Sure. I'll show you. <laughs> Traveling here. I'll show you. P R E V E L L I N G I N G Solo. Solo. This one. No. Oh, sorry. Number two. <laughs> Uh, traveling, traveling, solo, solo, vlogs. Vlogs. Yep. There we go. Now you, uh, now you guys are gonna be famous with me. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, no problem. That's me. I get subscribe. You'll see your, you guys will be on the channel. Go, go, go. So, so, uh, you go to Zakaria Street many ah. times. Seriously, this time only for Ram Ramadan special. Oh. This time. But other than you come, uh, you have uh, no street food, only for the hotels. Oh, oh, so only Ramadan is street food. Oh, only for Ramadan. Wow, okay. So I think I may have to try out some street food. Ah, you can get the Halim special. This one is. 
Fini, you know, I want to try it out right now. Oh yeah, Fini DJ too. One. This one, I can only get one, uh, one that's a, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, how much is this Ketna Pesa? Okay. Huh? 40 rupees. 40? 40, 40, okay. Just one second, let me pay you and then I eat. Okay, here you go. Uh, what, what is the name of this? Ferni. Ferni, Ferni, okay. Ferni. This is the first time trying to turn you, huh? Yeah, 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 just easy. Hey, actually, here, here, hold the camera, I'll try it out. Here, just one second. Guys, this is the first time trying out Fernie, let's give it a try. There you go, Bismillah. It's sweet. It's good. It's, it's like a sweet, like, paste kind of type of food. It's good. Yeah, it's really good. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Thank you, Salaam Alaikum. It's good. Hey, is it okay if you hold this real quick? Yeah, just record it. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Living. There we go. Alright. Give it more of a try. Yeah, yeah, it's on. It's on. Yeah. It's like creamy. It's creamy, sweet, pasty. Really interesting. Is it good? Thumbs up. It's good. It's good, guys. <laughs> All right, awesome. Very good. All right, thank you guys so much. I'm going to continue walking around the road and hopefully see you around the road. Nice to meet you. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Here you go. All right, take care, guys. I'll be walking around. Salam. Wow, oh, they even have some rickshaw guys over here, too. How are we even going to get through? It's like a traffic jam. I know, I'm gonna go through this right here, back alley. Really interesting. You know what's cool about this? Uh, something I wanna tell you, I think I already explained to you guys before in another video, maybe in this video. A lot of things are made of these like little clay pot things. After you're finished, you just throw it away. So it's very environment friendly. Like they don't use plastic, which is actually really good. Like you'll see like a lot of people dump plastic and stuff, which obviously is not nice wherever you go to in the world. But they do care for the environment, like they have all these clay pot things. So let me let me finish this real quick. Let me show you one more time. This is how it looks like. It's actually really good. So I'm gonna finish this real quick and I'll see the next shot. I just finished it and it was delicious. So if you do come to the street in Ramadan or whatever, try to find that food. I forgot what it's called, but it was tasty. That was a really nice dessert. Ramadan nighttime bazaars. Just gotta be careful for all my stuff. I gotta put my bag in front of me because it is very crowded. So from what I've heard, that apparently like all of these tents and stuff will not be up here usually. It's usually just hotels and a few meshes in this area. Oh, this place looks very crowded. I don't know what's happening over here, but let me see. Excuse me. Yeah. Mm, it seems like they like, like a lot of kebabs. You know what the famous thing over here is? The famous thing is kebab and uh, kebab. Ah. Kebab biryani. Kebab biryani. Yeah, because it's kebab biryani. Sweets. Look at the line. It's so big. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So this place is famous for kebab, biryani, and sweets, guys. Do you know, do you know the white sauce they're putting on? What, what is the white sauce? This is I think the uh, card. Huh? Card, card, card. Yeah. What is it? Sweet, uh, yeah. spicy. It's sweet, spicy. Oh, okay. You ready for this guy? All right, thank you so much. I'm just looking around the market. Well, thank you. Okay, welcome. Uh, this is the Ramadan vibes here in Kolkata, India. So I think people that are not Muslim or are Muslim all like to just come here for Ramadan because it's something cool, something they don't see all around here. 
Mutton, paya, halim. Halim is actually a famous food over here too. I think also they're selling outfits for Eid as well. Oh, this guy is selling halim. Famous Indian food over here. But the lines are just non-stop. Mutton halim. Full is 110, half 70. They have chicken and they have mutton. Something you will not find in India is beef. Halim, how's the halim? Good? Halim. Good. So it's such a long line. So this is only served in Ramadan? Yeah. Only in Ramadan, okay, cool. It's all about for Ramadan. Huh? All about for Ramadan. Ramadan, okay. Alright, enjoy. Oh, we have more of this thing that we saw earlier. We have dates. Guys selling belts. Wow, you can find anything over here in this market. I'm glad I came to this market. I think here would be a good... Uh, Good thumbnail. But it seems like uh, it's a little bit crowded over here, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a little detour, and then we go detour. Detour around. There we go. That's so how we go around the human traffic. In big cities like this, there's traffic with humans, there's traffic with uh, everything. A lot more, okay, so over there, I don't know if you guys can see real quick. A lot more kebabs and other stuff. What is wrong with that guy? He's tripping. <laughs> that, that guy is tripping. Okay, a lot of people are just pushing, so literally, if you look behind me, guys, you are just pushing. These people are just pushing that, especially that lady. So dirty. Say so excuse me, or just like don't like push. And I was moving with the traffic. Something, yeah, just have to watch out for some people, unfortunately. Okay, looks like this place where they wash the dishes. So I don't like to be in the crowd too much, guys, because it gets very hot and people are very pushy. The funny thing is the lady didn't go anywhere. It literally, she's right over there. So it seems like around Zakaria Street, there's also other stuff here too. Assalamu alaikum. Okay. Bread sellers here too. There's a lot of flies, unfortunately. Oh, what is this? Kind of looks like gulab juma, but not. What is this? Strawberry, strawberry. Strawberry? Yeah. Very good. Tasty. Very good. Very good, tasty. How much can the pesa? 20 rupees, 30 rupees, 40 rupees. 20, let me get 20 rupees. 20. Are you here the seller? Yes. Uh, hmm. You know what, maybe I come back. I just walk around. All right, thank you. Honestly, the cleanliness didn't look so good, but I was gonna try it out, but you know what I mean? I don't wanna just buy it and not eat it because I feel like that's bad. Because I like to be real with you guys. A lot of different fabric sellers over here. More of these wheat kind of things. And if you guys know what it is, please let me know. Wow, this place is very lively, that's for sure. Let's walk straight. Straight on Zakaria Street. Zakaria. And if you guys are wondering, what is the name Zakaria? It is name of one of the holy prophets, peace be upon him. Zakaria. And also it's the name of my nephew too. So, shout out to you baby Zag Zag. If you're watching this, which I doubt you are because you're a baby, basically you're like two, three years old. Yeah, but that's what... Uh, the name Zachariah comes from is it's a prophet and also my nephew. And sorry guys if the stabilization is not very good right now, but it's nighttime so usually stabilization on my camera isn't very good. But actually it's well lit up too, so maybe it is good. I'm not sure. 
Usually at night time, if it's not really well lit up, it starts being shaky. They have a lot of koofies here too. Matzah halim, chicken boneless halim, some strawberry drinks. Oh, well, there we go. So right over here is the masjid. I want to enter inside of the masjid, but you know guys, let's go inside of the masjid real quick and show you guys how it is. It's called the Nakho the masjid. Give you a brief view of the masjid real quick, overview. Actually, let's go inside and I'll talk more about it. All right, we have entered the masjid area, alhamdulillah. Because there are some guys at the front that I don't know, I don't know, they look like security or something, but I don't know. Don't let me record, but I guess it's okay to record. It's good. Wow, look at these minarets, guys. So this masjid has been here for about 100 years. 1926, what I've read online. Could be mistaken. So, yeah, we're just gonna investigate. And if I did not mention it before, because I did stop my camera, that about 10,000 worshippers are a lot in this masjid. And I guess a lot of people can chill out here, relax during the day. It's nice. Assalamu alaikum. Nice masjid. So let's go over here real quick. Assalamu alaikum. Assalam. People are praying over here. Oh, look at this. It's like the water fountain area. So I believe this is the area where people make wudu. So just before you pray, you should make wudu. And this is where the people are making their wudu area. This is really unique because usually in masjids, you do not see this. Usually they have like, oh actually, okay, so I guess they have two variations. Where that guy's washing is usually what you'd see in a masjid. And then, and then uh, here's also the water fountain area. So if you want to do the water fountain kind of thing, you can. But I don't know, for me it's a bit weird because I don't know, like the water seems like it's been used before. Or you could go over here and make wudu. Very nice. Assalamu alaikum. So if you're wondering what I'm telling people, Salaamu Alaikum, it just means like peace be upon you. It's like a normal uh, Muslim greeting. Just in case uh, some people are wondering if I'm Muslim or not, just say what's up to them. Give them a Muslim greeting so they know what's up. Now let's go upstairs and show you a little bit more. So this is supposed to be like the most unique masjid here in Kolkata. From what I've read online, a lot of people are like, come visit this mosque. So we're here in the mosque, here in the masjid. Let's go upstairs. Let's go up, up, up. Don't forget to smash that like button if you haven't already. I'm doing this for you guys and also for myself, it's a, good, it's a good memory, I think. So it's a win-win situation. It's a good memory to remember this day. I'm here in Kolkata and also, it's nice to show you guys the masjid. I wonder how many floors this masjid is. Oh, looks like the gate maybe is blocked off. Let's see. It's dark in this area. Can we go? Yeah, there's people there. Wow, this masjid is gigantic. There's another stairwell over here. It's over here. This might be like the lady section or something. I don't even know. All right. So another area where you can make your wash. We'll do. Is this the other level of the mosque? Yeah, it is. Just a little bit confusing because there's stairs going up and down and all around. Okay. Do, 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 do. Another section. Sex, the second floor. Let's see what's down. Down below us. Oh, here's the market, guys. But this is not Zekar. Oh, wow. So I believe this is not Zachariah Street, we're like towards the right and that guy just... They really need to stop letting like cars and stuff go to like streets which is... A, it's very heavily trafficked. Uh, 
I'm lost for word, guys, just because I'm so tired. But they should really let, they should really stop letting cars and motorcycles going through areas where there's a lot of people that are just walking. It just kills the vibe and it just makes it so crowded. Look at that, guys. Well, I don't work for the municipality or for the government here, but for the local government, but we're still gonna improve on that. Show you the ground of the mosque. So I believe it's all made of marble. See the little decorations over here. These like look like little minarets. A lot of fans, so it's not AC'd. This might be actually where the Imam, every Friday prayer, he might just speak over here. And then there are other floors, you can see over here. So this is four floors, I believe. So we're on the second, third, fourth, yeah. Wow, look at that, the dome, <laughs> very big. So 10,000 people can stay in here at one time. Oh, they even have a place to get some water too. Look at that. Nice. Cool guys, very nice. See this other side of the masjid or mosque. Mosque in English, masjid in other languages. Very beautiful. Seems like they upkept this pretty well for 100 years. A lot of maintenance, a lot of things. All right guys, so you guys have a gist of the masjid. I'm not gonna go all around it. You, you have a good feel of it and I, I have a good feel of it. So I think you have a good feel of it too. So that being said guys, let me go outside, get my shoes and maybe walk around a little bit more and see what's up. So Where are you from bro? I'm from America. Me? Where are you from? Uh, you from Kolkata? Where? Where are you from? I'm from West Bengal. Oh, you're from West Bengal. Yeah. Okay. Mashallah. So is this the best masjid to go to and visit? Yeah. Okay, alhamdulillah. So we found the best masjid. Because <laughs> online I heard this is like one of the best masjids to come visit. So I was like, I wanted to record a video, show Zakaria Road and show the masjid. Okay. okay. Assalamu alaikum. Now yeah, let's go down. We go down this way, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Go down this other stairwell. That guy was with his friends. I have to watch out. A lot of water puddles over here. I don't know where that's coming from. Because my socks got wet, actually. Assalamu alaikum. All right. I was going to stop the video, but it looks like we're almost at the entrance. Back at the entrance. So I guess Isha has not started yet. Guys cleaning the entrance. Oops. Okay. okay, awesome. Assalamu alaikum. Okay. Anyways, yeah, I like to uh, see the local culture over here. Very fascinating. Spider-Man. Oh no, it's not Spider- Is it Spider-Man? Yeah, Spider-Man. Interesting. 150. 150? Okay, let's, let's finish Zakaria Road real quick. Very hot. Even at nighttime, this place is very hot. Let's look at more of the things that they are offering over here. Looks like some Islamic stuff. Man, people are just so pushy over here. Literally, you stop for one second, you get pushed. Even I went off to the side. Ah, oh, whatever, that's just how it is over here. So yeah, guys, I think that's about it. This is Zakaria Road. And I appreciate you watching. I'm good, thank you.
And I think around this road too, there are other sellers, other people. EOT just, uh, there's a large market around here. I'm not sure exactly like, uh, oh my God. Uh, oh my God. I saw this guy's face. Let me give him some money. I feel so bad for him. I don't know if you guys saw it on camera. I don't even really want to show it, but it's not really nice. Here you go, brother. Alhamdulillah, man. Praise to God. Praise be to God that I'm okay. I'm healthy and I'm able to help out people. Oh, man. All right, that, that guy really, uh, I feel bad for him. But anyways, guys, uh, I hope you liked the video. I appreciate you watching it as always. To be walking around the market area and I think I'm gonna uh, go head back to my place where I'm at. But anyways, please smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I really appreciate that. If you want to see more videos around the world, click somewhere up on the screen. That being said, have a happy Ramadan. Have a happy day wherever you're at. And I'll see you later. Peace.